Hi everyone, I'm Nikki. Welcome back to the channel. Now every week I'm creating six new workouts for you guys, which is a mixture of either cardio or strength training. Today's routine, we're doing something a little bit different, which is a full body strength routine using a chair. So you will need a chair, obviously. A chair without sides or a stool will be fine. Now, it's a good alternative to your usual strength training routine, but you should still find this very challenging. And it's good for you if you perhaps don't like dumbbells or you don't have a set of dumbbells, or you just want a routine that you can take anywhere that's convenient whilst you're watching TV or your favorite film. Now, it is part of a series of workouts on my channel, which is part of the strength training series. So make sure that you check out the rest of the videos that fit into that. And just have fun. This is a routine that's suitable for all levels. There are a couple of routine um, exercises, sorry, that might be a bit tricky for you if you're a beginner, but just do what you can. And if you have to sit it out till the next set, then so be it. But I hope that you enjoy it. And if you do, make sure you share it and subscribe to the channel. Let's go. Okay guys, so this routine is nine exercises, two sets of each exercise, 40 seconds on, 20 seconds of rest mainly strength-based moves with one or two cardio moves thrown in there. But we're starting with a half squat. So for a half squat, we're going to squat down, lightly touch the chair, squeeze the glutes and come back up to standing, okay? So we're going down, squeezing to come back up. And we're gonna start that in eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. So there's no rush with it. Take your time. Squeeze those glutes on the way up. Keep the core engaged. Keep it nice and tight. That's it. Halfway. Really squeeze those muscles on the way back up. Good. Down and up. Down, up. Rest it off. Okay. Relax, give the legs a bit of a shake. And we're going again in five seconds, so get ready. Let's go. work guys halfway keep squeezing those muscles when you come up that's it and just a light touch on the chair three two one and rest it off good job next we are doing climbers so light mountain climbers but elevated so holding the chair by its sides and I'm gonna be picking the knees up. The more you cross the knees over, it will make it a little bit more difficult. Let's go now. Again, if you don't wanna jump the feet off, just step them in and out, and that's fine. Seven seconds left. Four, three, two, and one. Rest it off. Keep the core tight when we go again with that one. Make sure that you're holding the chair and really pushing it into the ground so it doesn't slide around too much. But yeah, let's get going. In, 
five seconds. Three, two, and one. Let's go. Remember, you can step it in if you don't want the jumping or if you're starting to fatigue. Otherwise, keep it moving. Four, three, two, and one. Rest it off. Excellent. So next, we are doing leg raises. So sitting down on the chair, raising those legs up so they're parallel with the floor. Hold for a second lower if again you prefer a modified version you can do one leg then on the next set switch legs otherwise let's do it pause at the top really squeeze those quads that's it excellent for the thigh muscles get them really working So, lift, squeeze, lower. Lift, squeeze, lower. That's it. Three, two, one. So if you were doing the single leg version, swap over to the other leg this time. Otherwise, like I say, make it a bit tougher. Use both legs at once. So rest it off, grab a drink if you need to, and we'll go again in Six seconds. Okay, three, two, one, let's go. And keep that chest nice and lifted. Sit up nice and tall. Good. Good. Good job. Three, two, and one. Okay, next we are doing tricep dips. So, down, push up, down, push up. Keep the chest lifted and really use the tricep muscles at the back of the arms to push yourself back up. The closer, three, two, one, the closer your feet are to the chair, the easier. Straighten your legs if you want, that's going to make it harder. Okay. So really make sure that you're engaging those triceps and using them to push the body up. Nice and slow. Two, one, and rest. We'll go again in 20 seconds. I'm going to grab a drink. And let's get ready to go again in three, two, and one. Halfway. <sighs> 10 seconds to go. Keep pushing. Come on, you can do it. Three, two, one, and rest. Good job. Okay, next, this one's quite a toughie. But you're going to be doing body lifts. So for body lifts, you need to keep the core engaged because you're going to use your hands to lift the body up 
Hold for five seconds and lower, okay? Three, two, one. Now, if this is too tough for you, then rest one leg and you just do it assisted, okay? And lower. So lift, two, three, four, five, and lower. Lift. And lower. Lift. And lower. Lift. And lower. Last five seconds. Two, one, and rest. That one's tough, right? <laughs> but yeah, like I say, you have got the modified option of keeping one foot on the floor and then just lifting. Um, instead of lifting both feet off the floor. Well, the choice is yours. So we'll go again in five, four, three, two, one, lift. And lower, lift. Lower, and lift up. Lower, three more lifts, come on. Lower, two more. And lower, and lift, last one. And lower, well done. Okay, next we're doing push-ups. So, you're gonna face your chair and have to be careful with this one actually that you're not pushing the chair away but push down and up let's go and again if you prefer a modified version then you can drop to your knees or when you fatigue and just keep pushing from there. 10 seconds to go. Four, three, two, one, and rest. Give those arms a roll. Ooh. Or circle the shoulders. And we'll go again in seven seconds, okay? So get ready. Really make sure you've got a stable grip on this so that your chair doesn't slide away. If your chair is sliding, then just drop to your knees. Keep going. Keep that core engaged. Halfway. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. And rest. Okay, next we're doing knee pull ins. So you sit on your chair, your legs are going out, and you're going to pull them in. Out, in. So this is going to work the core. Okay, and we're going in five, four, three, two, and one. Depending on what type of chair you've got, it might be a bit tricky actually with if you've got arms on your chair like me. So just hold it where it's comfortable. But as long as you've got the movement and you can feel that core, Pull those knees in. Again, bring the legs lower to make it easier. Eight seconds. Three, two, one, and rest. We'll go again with another set of those in just under 20. Get 
ready to go in five seconds. Three, two, one, let's go. Pull in. Really pull those, use those stomach muscles to pull the legs in, guys. Use them. Halfway, relax those shoulders. Twelve seconds to go. Seven. Three, two, one, and rest. Okay. Next, we are going to be doing scissors with the legs. Okay. So we're gonna go in five, no, six, five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. So, ball on the edge of the chair, lean back slightly. And a scissor. Again, it's gonna be slightly easier if you lower the legs, as opposed to keeping them up high. Keep scissoring halfway. Keep it going. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Shake those legs off. Have a go again. In a few seconds. If you are new to this channel and you like this workout, make sure that you do subscribe and make sure that you check the community tab for updates and you can follow me on IG Nicola Life Fitness. But we'll get going in three, two, one. Scissor. I thought this workout would be a little bit different to the standard dumbbell routines, etc. So it's just good to change up what you're doing. Keep the body guessing. And it's just more fun that way, I think. Halfway. Keep going. Ten seconds. Six, five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Okay. Last exercise knee sweeps. Legs start to the left, pull in and tighten the stomach muscles to bring the knees across. So you're kind of doing a semicircle motion with your knees as well as squeezing the core as you do it. Three, two, one. So sweep them from left to right. But like I say, make sure that you engage in the core because that will not only help you lift, get the legs up, but also make sure that you're working the right muscles. Halfway. Keep moving. Five, four, three, two, one. And rest. And then we'll go into our last set. In a few seconds. Chill out for another 10. Shake off those legs. In four, three, two, and one. Engage that core. Pick those knees up. Good. Keep it moving, halfway. A few more seconds to go. 15. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good job guys, well done. I hope you enjoyed that routine. If you did, make sure that you subscribe 
and make sure that you follow me on Instagram, which is Nicola Life Fitness. Drop comments, let me know how you got on because that was a bit different, so I'd be interested to know how you found it. Other than that, check out the rest of the strength training series on the channel. There are there's everything from no equipment to equipment, dumbbells, etc. So yeah, check it out. And I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Until then, take it easy and I'll see you soon. Bye.